Hello, hello. I feel like I keep coming to you guys from the car. If you see me jolt forward, it's because we're braking. Uh, <laughs> don't worry, Marty's driving. We are gonna go to a new place to eat and I'm very excited about it. It's called Cook, uh, is it The Cook Shack or is it just Cook Shack? I don't know, but they have chicken, salads, and brisket, I think, or something, barbecue. I don't know, it's supposed to be good. A coworker recommended it. And then they built one that's not like as far away. So it's still, it's still a drive, but it's not as far. So I am gonna actually film the food this time. <laughs> I know in my last vlog I did not because um, I just got that scheduled to go out tomorrow. So I hope you guys enjoy it, it's a short one. Uh, tomorrow I'm going to the beach. So excited to bring you guys along for the weekend. Okay. Again, uh, sorry for the weird sunlight, but the sun is setting. The food was good, I think anyway. Um, I would say it was, I don't know what, like seven out of 10? I feel like it was chicken, I got chicken and waffles. I, I will I have shown the clip by now. Um, I thought it was good. Marty got his chicken sandwich. What'd you, what'd you think about it, babe? I mean, overall, it's a pretty good experience. I think the food is pretty, pretty delicious. Quality was on point. Presentation was a okay out of for ten. the type of restaurant. So I want to rate it. Well, you rated it a seven. Yeah, seven out of ten. That's a little high. I would rate it more like a yeah. six point four. I thought you would rate it higher than that. I mean, that's like honestly where a lot of good food lives. Honestly. Okay. Very few things are like eight and nine. So. But I think texture-wise, your chicken was better. I'd probably just stick to chicken and waffles rather than chicken sandwich. Okay. But there's a lot of options on there, so we'll just have to eat there again. Oh yeah, we're definitely going back. Anyway, hi guys. We are trying a Reese's Crunchy, hold on. A Reese's Crunchy Snack Cake. So, we got Marty's head out of the way so it focused. What? It was showing, it was focusing on your face instead of the packaging. There you go, my good sir. This is dessert, by the way. Marty found it at the checkout. Looks like this. Oh. I'm not really sure where the crunch is. Truthfully, it's kind of gross. That's not good. I don't want it. I took one bite. I don't want it. It's not even like appetizingly sweet. Mm -mm. Not good. Zero out of ten. Don't recommend. Hey guys, we have made it home and I'm going to show you what we picked up this evening because we did end up going to Academy and Walmart. Let me just show you. I'll start with Academy. Um, I got a Frisbee for the beach. I think that'll be super fun for me and my friend and probably me and her kid to throw around. Uh, it'll be good exercise and it'll be something to do while we're there. Probably before it gets way too hot because I'm not about that life. And then... I found this shirt. I did not plan on getting a shirt while we were there, <laughs> but it's got a chicken on it. <laughs> it says too blessed to be stressed and it's got a chicken. I mean, what? So cute. I love it. It's chicken. <laughs> I wasn't going to get it, but Marty grabbed it and basically told me I was. Now, that was what we got at Academy. Then. At uh, Walmart, Marty's coming. <laughs> Are you gonna get in the video? You're in it. Hi. 
<laughs> okay, he's just gonna show his feet off. Um, I got a zero sugar fruit punch Gatorade, a zero sugar lemon lime because they did not have my lime cucumber, so we're going with that. Marty got a Naruto G Fuel, which looks pretty cool, honestly. Cool can. And Marty picked out some Sweet Tarts Ropes candy. So he'll be enjoying that. And Marty also picked out a Celsius Tropical Vibe Sparkling Starfruit Pineapple Edition Energy Drink. So that should be interesting. We've never had Celsius. You haven't had Celsius, right? No. But people have been talking about it, so he thought he'd give it a shot. We normally buy Bang. So that is pretty good. And then I got a three pack of some sugar-free Orbit Sweet Mint Gum. And I got some Lily's Gummy Bears. So I normally buy Lily's chocolate, but I've never seen the gummy bears. And I thought it looked good. So they were a tad bit expensive, but they're also no sugar added. So I guess if you don't want to eat 40 grams of sugar, you pay the no sugar tax. Good morning. It is Saturday, 7-16, so yeah. And it is 6.48 in the morning. It is early. I do not normally get up this early on a Saturday. But as you know, we're going to the beach. Yay! I'm very excited. Okay guys, we made it back from the store. I got a little meal, although I probably won't do that again because it was like $7 for a couple boiled eggs, some grapes, wheat crackers, and cheese. Just saying that's expensive, but I got these really pretty flowers for like $4. So I'm gonna put those in water and then I'm gonna try to put away all the dishes before my friend gets here because they're everywhere and you can't see them, but I can, so. Yeah, you can't see them because they're all right here. Anyway, let's let's get to doing hey that. Hey guys. Okay, so we made it to the beach. Um, yeah, I know, last clip was at the house, but yeah. Here's our view. It's not good yet. Yay! All right, we're gonna go to those chairs over there. That's the goal, so. The beach was so much fun. Um, we were there for like three and a half hours, I think. And I'll have to get a clip, but like the only thing that sunburned was like the top of my thumb. But they were exposed to the sun the most, so that makes a lot of sense. And also I was like slipping my shoes on and off. Um, I had a crazy experience with a porta potty. Uh, let's just say mine and the one next to it had a whole and they were like lined up and so i like made sure nobody was in there and then i just like went for it and then ran out because it was so scary <laughs> um because yeah you could totally just like see into the other porta potty <laughs> uh i've never experienced that before i don't know why anyone would cut a hole in the side of a porta potty but anyway that good morning everyone it is sunday the beach was so nice yesterday we had so much fun, and then we left when it got way too hot. So now it is 
9 10 a.m on sunday and we have another full day ahead of us of course um so it's my stepdad's birthday today well it was his birthday yesterday but we're celebrating today so we're gonna go to church and then we're going to eat probably per usual and then i'm not sure what we're gonna do after that because we're gonna be in the area where the restaurant is so marty said wear comfortable clothes wear comfortable shoes which is not super doable but we'll make it work also this dress <laughs> cute uh it's from target so yeah it's an isabel maternity dress and it is the softest material and it's like so flowy and comfy and the only thing i think i should be able to wear it after it's a little bit longer than i had wanted but it's fine anyway i'm gonna eat breakfast Hey guys, it is much later. I've obviously thrown my hair up and changed. We have made it home. It's 10 o'clock at night. <laughs> uh, we ended up hanging out at my parents, then going to dinner with them, and then going back and hanging out at their place. So yeah, we finally just got home and we are gonna wind down for the evening. I won't say go to bed because we're probably not going to bed yet, but we're gonna wind down, so bye. Thank you for watching.